Hey yo everyone, Andrew here, bringing you another video, and today we're going to be doing a beginner's guide to Wonder Woman. Brief history on Wonder Woman. Wonder Woman's real name is Diana, and she is part of a Greek tribe known as the Amazons. Now the Amazons were given protection by the Greek gods in mortality, and they live on an island known as Themyscira, cut off from the rest of the world. Wonder Woman was made of clay by her mother, and upon reaching adulthood, she won a contest to become a goodwill ambassador and diplomat for Themyscira to Man's World. Upon reaching Man's World, Wonder Woman becomes more of a superhero than a diplomat or ambassador. She teams up with other superheroes, becomes a founding member of the Justice League, and also becomes a defender of all that is innocent and good and peaceful. Personality of Wonder Woman Wonder Woman is a new, unique character because she has a dual personality. On one hand, we have the Wonder Woman who is kind, compassionate, loving, forgiving, and always looking for a diplomatic solution before ever taking up arms. But on the flip side, we have a character that is aggressive, a warrior, somewhat savage at times, very powerful, quick to attack, and is willing to fight when necessary. These two aspects, blended together, make the character of Wonder Woman. She is a bringer of peace, but a master of war. And it works. The character has a good balance between these two. It's a tough balance, but one that works. Powers and Abilities Wonder Woman's powers and abilities is increased speed, increased strength, increased durability, and increased reflexes. Not quite to the level of, say, Superman or Captain Marvel, but still higher than that of a normal individual. With the durability, she can still be pierced by bullets, swords, knives, or any other piercing object. However, she has the durability to withstand attacks from punches like Superman. She also has the ability to flight, and she also has various different items to help her in her pursuit of justice. These items would be... Her indestructible bracelets, which can be used to deflect bullets, lasers, and other projectiles. Her golden lasso of truth, which has many different properties over the years. However, its main property is to confine someone and force them to tell the truth. And lastly, she has her tiara, which from time to time has been used sort of like a projectile, throwing it and attacking people with it. Wonder Woman. Going into Wonder Woman, what do you expect? Well, Wonder Woman's comic is a superhero comic, but it's unique compared to all the other superhero comics because it has a magical sense to it. If you look at the DC Trinity, Superman, Batman, and Wonder Woman, they're all superheroes, larger than life superheroes, but they all have a different theme to their comics when it comes down to their raw material. Superman is a comic of science fiction in that there's space travel, aliens, robots. Batman is a superhero comic that deals with crime, street-level crime, the common criminal, as well as sociopath and psychopaths. And Wonder Woman is a superhero comic that deals with mysticism, magic, and various different cultures and their mythologies. If you're interested in a comic that has mysticism, magic, action, while at the same time a strong character that you can look up to, Wonder Woman is the place to go. She's an interesting character, and a character that has a lot to offer. That said, this is Andrew saying, peace out for now.